time now to concern ourselves with kidney health. Uh, these might be two organs you don't think about a whole heck of a lot if you've never had problems, but most of us know someone who's had an issue, or maybe two. And so making sure we keep kidneys on our mind matters. And one group in Delaware is working hard to do exactly that. We would like to introduce to you this afternoon two members of the General Federation of Women's Clubs, the GFWC Delaware. Mm -hmm. um, Robin Hayes is the 2022-2024 Health and Wellness Chair. Trish Rodriguez is the Delaware State President. Ladies, thank you so much for stopping by yeah, today. Thank, thank you for having us. You. So uh, tell me about the Kidney Health Project. Um, I'm a dietitian and a diabetes care and education specialist, and I spend a lot of time every day talking about why kidneys are important, mm -hmm. and we talk about it in terms of overall kidney profile for your health, right. but we don't usually talk about it as, a, as an organ system. We don't usually do that. So it occurred to me a few weeks ago uh, when I was at a presentation that a nephrologist casually said that most of us will only have 50% kidney function by the time we're 80. And it kind of took me back a little bit, and then I thought, okay, aging process, that makes sense. But then I started thinking about my own perspective, and when I'm interpreting blood work, in many cases, I'm only, I only know someone has a problem when they have a problem. Right. Mm -hmm. So I started thinking about the fact that maybe how our blood work is set up, we don't always see it as a patient. Yeah. So we, last year we were perfectly normal and now we have stage three chronic kidney disease. So I kind of thought that maybe there was more to this that I as a healthcare professional would want to know about and maybe the lay person would want to know more about. Okay, yeah. And Trish uh, asked me to be the 2022-2024 20, um, Health and Wellness Chair for the, for the GFWC Delaware and I thought what a perfect opportunity to do this project that could impact all of Delaware yeah. in a very positive way. Right. Yeah. Kidneys are not a very sexy disease state to talk about, but it's, it impacts all of us. And like you said, we have two of them, but I have a good friend who never knew she was only born with one. Oh, wow. Or maybe someone donates one. Sure. Or sure. maybe they were in a car accident and there was kidney injury. There are a lot of kidney stones. Mm -hmm. um, diabetes and high blood pressure are the top two reasons people will end up with kidney problems. Mm -hmm. But if we're not really thinking about it, we're not protecting our kidneys overall right. in general. So yeah. Trish, the organization, your organization is partnering up with other community organizations in this project? Uh, not at this point, not until after Wednesday. We're going to have a very special dinner, but not at this point, but we, our plans are. Uh -huh. Our perspective is to become associated and co collaborate with other organizations, but our clubs, are going to take, we have 24 clubs in the state of Delaware. So we would encourage each club to get involved at their local community level and create an awareness in the community about uh, kidney health. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So it says here, mm -hmm. everybody knows somebody with a kidney issue. Yeah. It's true. Is there really that many? Yeah, and um, this coming Wednesday, the 30th, I'm where the GFWC Delaware is sponsoring a dinner program. And it will, I'm calling it a plenary. A plenary is an opportunity where people come together and learn about a subject, right. and then they try to problem solve. Okay. So we're going to do a dinner program where everyone that's a layperson comes and learns about kidney health, and then during the dessert hour, or time frame, we're going to have the experts that we've invited help us and direct us and make sure that we create messaging that's appropriate um, and that all of next year we're going to spend promoting what good kidney health is. Oh, so idea. maybe we'll come up with each county will have a strategically placed billboard yeah. that will have something. Or maybe we'll create bookmarks for all the libraries. But we want to do something that has messaging that is appropriate for everyone. And I don't want to be that person to say, this is what we need. Right. I'll be the moderator, but I want everyone that comes to feel like they've had a voice and they can say what they need because they know someone. Uh, one of our women that will be there, I just found out yesterday, her son has been on the wait list for 15 years and just found out that hopefully by the end of this year we'll have a new kidney. Oh, and wow. we're just, I mean, those are the stories that I hear a lot in my daily work, yeah. but it's, it's even more 
um, amazing to hear it in relation to this particular project. Yeah. You know, you, when you started talking about the kidneys, mm -hmm. it really was kind of surprising to me, things I did not know. About. Yep. Are you hoping that people will learn new things and then take it out into the community? Absolutely. Yes, yeah. that's why I think having all these people from all over the state present. I think that we'll all learn something. I mean, I can sit here and tell you the facts, like drink more water and, and make sure you walk or, or do things that are very preventative. But I really want to hear from the people that have been impacted by it. I don't want this to be that I know what the real answers are. I want everyone to be organically creating this. And then I think it will have amazing um, lift yeah. for sure. next year. I think it's going to really roll up really well. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, that's awesome. Wow. Yeah. Thank you so much. And when's the dinner again? It's Wednesday? This, this Wednesday, it will be at Roma Italian Ristorante in the Dover area. We are still accepting um, participants. We have about 10 to 15 more slots open where we can accept people. So you know, we'd love you to come. All right. This, we'll have the information on our website. Thank yes. you very much. Get in there quick. All right. Robin Hayes and Trish Rodriguez, thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you very much thank for you. having us. Wonderful talking to you.